Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Thaumaturge. Um, I'm very sleepy, but I gotta record. So here we are. Anyways, um, what was I doing? I, I need a moment. A refresher. I have four skill points. Uh, I'm not gonna touch those for a bit, but, but... What is, what is G again? It's like my... Fuck you. Journal. We had a few more of these. Um, I cannot do the Imperial Hotel. Because I don't know how to get there. Uh, well, I don't know how to get into it. So we're going to do this London Bar one. Got two of these and then we can investigate the woman in the water. Not these guys. I don't know who they are. All these quests are quite limited. To what extent? I don't know. Maybe at like a certain point in the story, you know? Probably. Now watch us find another one of these while trying to investigate the bar. I would Ew. I wouldn't mind. But I don't want to spend all video doing this again. All right, that was the bar. Okay, uh, we also have the grave digger quest. Um, let's get this one done, and then we'll. Focus up a bit. What is this? That's a ball card. Maybe I should do the cemetery quest, but I want to do whatever quest gets me more of, uh, um, I'm forgetting what they're called. What are they called? What are these little guys called? One of these little buddies called, huh? Help? Salutors. I want to get more of those, because uh, that last fight was kind of rough. Because I didn't have the necessary upgrades. Okay, what is this? Alright. Whatever. Guess we're, guess we're doing it. Guess we're not doing it. I guess we're not doing this. Guess we are doing it. What is this foolishness? Open this gate. Right. No one can keep us from entering the cemetery. These guys have weird country. names. Well, how long I don't have a water. To keep Shit. Cheese. If it's closed, it's closed. Oh, Mr. Shulsky, finally. There's a very thick sweater that man has on. Got your message. I read your message. What is it about? Ah. Uh, I won't talk about it out here in front of these boors. Come inside. What did you, you call him? Man, grave digger. What the hell is going on? Shut your mouth. man southern. I won't open till judgment day. This is about your father, you know. Okay. All right. Let's see what this is about. Bah. Bah. Fucking sheep. What did my father do this time? I've got two pieces of news, so to speak. There's bad news, and I'm not sure what the other one is. Which do you want to hear first? Bad. Tell me the bad news. Today some rebel rousers came here and started making trouble. They ravaged your family too. What do you mean, ravaged? I couldn't believe it either. I sent you a note immediately. What about the other news? One night, I went out and saw the dead lying around. But not in their places, you know? In the pathways. And then I saw their graves dug up, as if the dead crept right out of the ground. And these bodies are still lying here? No, of course not. You can't do that. But if you want to learn more about the case, they might come out again tomorrow night. 
People are starting to talk about resurrections and the end of the world. Resurrections and now these maniacs. Judgment Day seems to be upon us, you know? You know what else seems to be upon us? I'm going to select something and go get a bottle of water. Those vandals that ravaged the tomb, what did they look like? I closed the gate because they're still hanging around there. Why don't you see for yourself, you know? Okay, that was really quick. It was like... According to my knowledge, I had a bottle the nearby. Don't rise in Lucky. Were there any witnesses? Any noise at night? Traces? Nothing. Just the stiffs in odd places. Mm-hmm. Goodbye. Get rid of this scum at once. Yes, sir. What is this? Admire that view. I don't know if I've already done this. Possibly I have. Now that I'm here. Okay. Locked place of respite. There's something over here. Something to do with, uh... Notes from a sermon. Am I a magician or what? Lesson in a trendy dance. Okay. We got a point for that, right? Take a dance lesson? Uh, sorry, grave digger, but I must go take a dance lesson. Let's, uh... Let's get this done. Investigate the case of corpses coming back to life. Should I have been paying attention to uh, where to do that? Cool. Thaumaturgy never fails me. There is something here. The flame is still smoldering a toppled candle. The smell of kerosene from the still smoldering wick gives way to the profound sense of injustice. Never fails me. There is something here. Settled on the candle in the wisp of bluish smoke from the flickering flame. I can feel a grievance over the fact that they pay more to dig up a stiff than to bury them. Trace unknown. Don't know why they don't know why that I don't I don't know why I clicked that. I'm sleepy. Ha 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 excuses. It's an obituary. It's published a few days ago. The funeral has been held recently. The crumpled newspaper page pages ooze with someone's cool, cynical calculation. They use the obituary page as a map to find those waiting to be dug up. So is this just like a simple case of a grave robber? Or does this have to do with any of the guys that were outside the house uh, at the uh, will reading? Who are... What the hell? Oh, darn it. Look at him. I think he's a real, you know, temperamancer. I'll show you how you talk to magicians. Are you so eager to die, temperamancer? This guy looks like he can fuck me up. Then who are you, anyway? We're the ones who purge the world from scum like you. Not that guy, though. I'm a bit sorry now. But I think you will be too, in a moment. You heard him. He asked for it. And has a weird Damn. body. Not shaming. Just looks, <laughs> looks kind of fucking weird. All right, this looks. This is gonna be. This is gonna be simple. Um. Um. You don't have the salad tour to disable it. Okay. Okay, so who should we tackle first? This guy makes you immune to gaining new negative states. So he can't gain negative states. And this guy makes you immune to gaining new negative states. Okay. I just I just got to pick one. Let's take this guy out first, because if he beats me, I'm going to be quite upset. So I need uh, the Bukovac. Excuse me. I need you. Alright, can you, uh, bite his fucking head off? It's very slow, but it's gonna do 18 to 21. It disables his trait. 
inflicts damage equal to eight for each enemy suffering. Okay, well, we don't have that. Howl. Cast states suffering on an enemy, but doesn't his, uh, makes him immune. He's immune to that. Hit him with the very slow attack, I guess. And what I'll do is I'll cause him to suffer. Because even if he kills me, you know, he's still going to a big bitch. So he's suffering. Okay, so the Bukovach is going to fuck him up a little bit. Now this, like, okay, that's, that's the indicated damage from him. Fuck it. Maybe we can get that double damage. No? Ow, bitch. Ah, cunt. They're fucking kicking me. Okay. Quick attack. Takes out Fedora. Let's do it. Swap to Upir. Since that guy... That guy we can't... We can't hurt that guy yet. That's why I want to try to get all the salad tours I can right now. I probably shouldn't have done this quest right off the bat, but... It's kind of like... In the same area. Also... Didn't realize I would, they were just here. <laughs> I don't think I have any negative statuses. But, but, but... I am going to need to focus on my focus after this. Reducing his focus seems kind of pointless if I'm only doing one at a time. He's got four. Um... restore a bit of my health I guess punch ah. I have an idea. That way he can start getting his, uh, fucked up. Ow. Let's go for it. Double damage, double... Focus on this guy. <laughs> oh! We got him with the double. So, double damage would be six. Eh. Make him suffer. Just, just make him suffer. He looks so silly when he goes to attack me. Oh my god, this... Suffering OP? Give him a give him yeah, give him a little tap. What's that fucking question mark down there? <laughs> He's definitely dead with this though. But is he dead with this? We'll see. Uh Yeah, do that. I don't care. Bah! No, he's not. He was quite fine. Now he's dead. Okay. Examine the area of the Sorsky family tomb. Let me finish the additional objective first.
Oh yeah, it was. I was under the assumption this was taking place somewhere else. But that was the other quest it swapped to, huh? With the dancing lessons. My bad. I'm half asleep. Ha 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 ha. I shouldn't use that as an excuse. It's true though. You can tell I'm extra sleepy when I start to ramble and walk into gravestones. Thanks for the XP, dead guy. <laughs> I felt something. Where is it? On the deadly cool tombstone, the grave digger has left words of prayer and a concerned string on the marble. The concern that the dead won't rest in peace in accord with the laws of nature. There's something on nearby. It's a harbinger of the apocalypse, the third one this week. Okay, alright, cool. Up here. The things people come up with. Lily petals. The last lilies from the garden picked with the intention of bringing her joy fell on the cobblestones when he saw her walking arm in arm with another man. The symbol of purity has been tainted with black ink. May she regret her decision. Is she fucking dead? Off white. People's envy is boundless. So why should anyone care about it? The fleur de lis pattern? I know what a fleur de lis is. It's just reading it that's fucking weird. Uh, is a bold move. The jacquard vest with, will dazzle everyone. And the ruby red will be the talk of the town. New world fashion doesn't know the virtue of modesty. Let them be envious. I have anything to do with my fucking quest? Who the fuck is this? Palouche, look what they got dragged in. God damn. Are you the ones that so so saw your buddy strewing the bodies all over the graveyard? Hey, no, people am I gonna fight? Not there. We are professionals. We've got the troublemaker here. I bet he'll call the Undertaker. That's too bad. How did, how did the Undertaker not see six motherfuckers? I'm gonna threaten him. The grave digger I'm not taking this shit. To see all this looting. Fuck, I knew Thursday would be no good. Don't be a sissy. It'll be all over soon. I'll take the coat. I'll take the cloth hoppers. What the fuck's a cloth hopper? Sounds racist. Okay. Alright, one second, boys. Don't have it. Got it. Got it. Alright. Okay, I forgot about these. I have them now. Let's take a moment and look this over. What the fuck? Oh, I'm a fool. These go on here. All right. Old wound. Agony. That's what I was using, right? To make them suffer. What can I put on that? Makes you lose focus instead of taking damage. I don't see how that works. Gives a 50% chance of interrupting an enemy's planned action. Kind of cool. Slowing the enemy's actions. Increases the damage from a Salator's next attack by 50. Okay. This restores focus, but like, mega. It mega restores. And I can only do the strong attack if their, you know, focus is broken. Is there anything I can put on to like help reduce their focus? Restores 4 points for every enemy in the suffering state. How do I use Agony? Okay, wait, this is Suffering. <laughs> Receive 3 to 4 damage at the end of every round, max 4. Receives 3 to 4 damage at the end of every round, max 4. How do I just use Agony? 
Maybe that is what I have. They're the same thing. I just don't know which. Okay. Uh. So. Dumb question. If I put this on there, will I gain four by causing them to have suffering? Each subsequent action that restores health points will restore less of it. I feel like that's going to be on anything that uh, receives three to four damage. <laughs> okay. I can just put this on, on that, I guess. Wait. How do I use this? I should have paid more attention to tips. Okay. That could be double damage. Right. Maybe I don't have quick attack. Maybe I have that. Maybe it like evolved like a Pokemon. Maybe I'm too sleepy <laughs> to know this. All right. I need to be on the lookout for action, reaction, and agony for this fight. Fist, the face getting punched and uh, uh, coming. Right, right, right. Increased damage taken by 50%? For, for me? The Salatar's next action will be run one round faster. Increases the damage from the next attack. Okay, it's quite nice. So I'm, I'm going to assume that that's going to be 3 instead of 2. 1, 2, 3. Okay. But I'm pretty sure I'm using these because it's giving me those buffs. You know? But how do I... How do I use that? Oh, clicking it just fucking gets rid of it. Okay, um... Was that already on there? Eight to nine, five to six. I'm gonna see how this works, or if I can even use agony. But if I can't, I can cast uh, old wound on them and then have the salutor attack. I'm probably not going to remember to do that. Okay, but this is, uh, makes every attack on the enemy deal the maximum damage. And that's like a buff for me. So if I use that, I'll be buffed for... Seven rounds? I'm a little confused. That's okay. <laughs> okay, for this one, quick punch. Causes suffering. Strong attack? I don't really break their focus. I need upgrades to break focus faster. That might be a good, uh, uh, Salutor skill, though. I'm just gonna run it like this. Okay, so, wait, how do I, I see the two over there, no, go back, how do I, how do I make that two, do I need to use it twice, I feel like I'm missing something quite important here, okay, tell you what, tell you what, tell you what, this is the guy we can't fuck up. 
That's just negative states. I don't. I think. I think. I think old wound's a negative state. Uh, let's cast old wound. No, no, big guy. Take down the ug ugliest fuck first. Old wound. And uh. What's his? Okay, he, it, we need something quick. That's gonna that's gonna cast suffering. So let's not do that. Let's see if we can interrupt him and howl at him. That worked. Okay. Says that's still one though. Maybe I need to use this. Okay, that's a two. That's evolved. Increases inflicted damage by 50. Use it on him. And you? Uh. Do that. Ah, fuck. Okay, I'm bleeding. Not great. That's go. That's going back to one. So I need to use it. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So it's like a combo. Okay, okay, okay. He's gonna die. So let's move on. I I am curious though about something else. Um. Reduces damage taken by eighty. Okay. Suffer. Restores four health. And now I just cause suffering. So I should change that. Now that I know this is a combo thing, I get you. But what I wanted to know, if I go to him, it's still a combo. Okay, cool. Uh, so... What was my combo for this? I don't know, but let's see if we can interrupt. You? You need a howl. Actually, no, no, I need you. Slow, slow. Reduces focus, removes negative status. Okay. Because I'm bleeding right now. And now I'm bleeding again. Punch him. Do that, do the, do this again. Do it again. Dead. It doesn't matter. Dead. Okay. I was actually kind of wanting to do that to see what the second combo was. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. I have a better insight on this now. I I should read more. Pay more attention. My fault. What am I doing? We've killed six people. Nearby. But I'm not sure what I'm looking for. Me. There is something here. What are you saying to me, man? What am I missing? Do I need to go back up there to where those dead guys are? There's those dead guys. There's these dead guys over here somewhere. There's something odd nearby. Could you uh inform me of where this is? Thaumaturgy Please. Never fails me. There is something here. Where? Go talk to the Undertaker. Gravedigger. So, Mr. Shulsky. Hey. You gave those lads by the tomb a good belting, huh? I could hear the echoes. Thank you. But they weren't too keen to talk. 
and I have a few questions to ask. Maybe I could help, you know? Bury him. It's a rather grim job you've got here. Well, you know. I'd rather do this than struggle with drunkards in a bar or bolts in a factory. The dead are calm and predictable, you know? Unless they start rising from the grave, that is. Goodbye. I'll just stand here. Okay. What am I doing? What is what is this in the journal? Speak to me. Okay. There's probably like one thing I'm missing from somewhere. Let's take a look around. What what is what is that? What is What is that? Is that a part of the quest? You trying to fuck with me right now? Oh. What is it? <laughs> Am I getting fucked with it right now? You better watch yourself. Game. I don't know what else it wants me to do, man. Investigate the cases of corpses coming back to life. I From felt something. Where is it? You're confusing the hell out of me, man. I felt something. Where is it? I don't see shit. I see shit. What is 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 up here. Where are you, son of a bitch? I felt something. Where is it? It's a shovel. The worn out shaft <laughs> radiates with fresh alarm and fear. Someone hastily dropped a tool as soon as they heard approaching footsteps. Did I startle someone? There's more. There's more to this case. What is this? What are you telling me? Over here? I'm basically a dog. Sniffing out shit. The tomb. Fresh trace of pain raises above other memories that statue has been a silent witness to. The widower's trembling hand seeking support, its vibrations permeate the bricks with a mixture of revulsion and grief caused by the nasty sight of the corpse of his uh, recently buried wife perched on her open coffin. The living dead. There is no miracle nor imminent apocalypse. The resurrected corpses are assisted by a prankster who not only knows the place well but also works here. The question is, why does he do it? The grave digger should know him. Okay. That's the same conclusion I was starting to draw. Hello. So, Mr. Shulsky. I searched the area. Grave robbers are more of a separate issue, but I learned something about the rising corpses. I'm dying of curiosity. Do you understand? It seems that the corpses are helped in their wanderings by someone who knows the cemetery well and keeps their tools here. Hold on. My hands are clean. And is frustrated by how little you pay him. Eh, he's my assistant. Are you saying he's involved in this? Yes. Where can I find him? And he probably drinks with those friends of his own in Green Square. That louse. If you meet him, tell him he's fired. We're for wrong. Whatever. Goodbye. I'll just stand here.
Uh. How? Yeah, I can't leave, can I? Let's go. Let's go investigate the tomb, and then maybe I can leave. But is the tomb like also tied to the prank? So this is just a prank. We got a discarded crowbar. A crew tool as crude as the men who used it. The steel reverberates with a desire to destroy what is strange, corrupted by magic and unfamiliar. Just like what they are instructed to uh, by the Waz. Oh. Uh, a, a page? Demons was? My father a demon? Fine. Let them have it their way. Okay. Let's go talk to the gravedigger again. This just wasn't really a filler episode. I think, yeah, I think it might count as a filler. We've done nothing. Uh, we're, we're doing a quest. Oh, Side quest. Mr. Shulsky. Not quite filler, not quite, you know. What is the WAS? Those fellas at the mausoleum oh. were connected with it. That's, ah, that's what I should be saying. Also anti thaumaturge society. Loonies, you know. Ever since your father was laid to rest here, they've been yelling their heads off by the walls. Where can I find their bosses? You know? Why? Do you smell blood? There's one behind the cemetery wall inciting the crowd. Ask him. Once you have cleaned up near the mausoleum, I can open the gate. Okay, the lunatics from WAS. The Gravedigger says the WAS stands for Warsaw anti Thaumaturge Society. I feel like there definitely should be a T in there. The what's? Their agitator can be found by the cemetery wall. It's a vendetta. The Warsaw anti Thaumaturge, Thaumaturge Society has targeted my father. Normally, I would say be my guest, but they're acting so nastily. I put them on my blacklist. In order to learn more about them, I should find their agitator by uh cemetery wall. Goodbye. You know what? Good luck. I was gonna say I agree with them. Just because I can't pronounce some of these words, but that's uh that's not the way to do things. Now I can leave. Okay. So should I Should I focus on this instead of trying to finish this one so that I can acquire Morana? Should I in I don't know this motherfucker, but Morana, if we get her, helps with the mind. So The fuck do I go over? Come on. Okay. So that's probably her. If we get her, we can level up our mind. And that can help break down defenses. I don't think we get... Then we can, you know, finish that quest. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go and end it here. And then the next one, we're going to focus on finishing her quest. Because we haven't really started it. And then do it that way. So far, we haven't hit a huge brick wall in um, these fights, but I, I do think if they start to get more difficult, who knows when that can happen. The one fight of those two women kind of, you know, egged on, that one was kind of difficult, but what the fuck was that noise? <laughs> oh, is someone crying? Oh, hey, that's the guy for this quest, but... That's what I'll do. Try to get that uh that chick and then uh what was the other one? Entries? It's gonna be under uh oh fucking scroll works, okay. Word Paimon. 
Isn't that the... Isn't that the demon from, uh... Hereditary? <laughs> okay, cool. Prequel. Cool. Don't know how to focus on getting her. Or him. I don't... Anyways. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, definitely gonna do more in the next one. Now that I have a decent game plan. This one was just gonna be me doing more small shit. It kind of was. A few fights thrown in there. I got to got to get a more of a handle on this uh, combat system, which uh, I like, and I do like this game. But a lot of times when I record, I'm getting off work. And I'm sleepy as fuck. And this is uh, it's not a game you really want to play sleepy. So if at any point like I seem like I'm not feeling it, it's not the game. It's me. Typically, if it is the game, I'll say so. But it's not the case with this one. It's definitely very interesting. But if I go lay down right now, I'm going to go to sleep. So with that mindset playing this game, it kind of clashes. But I am very interested in it, and I, I'm going to keep playing it. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye.